Ich habe immer noch mega fit aus, ja, aber der Mäntel her. Wow, glaubst du, kommst du das? <lacht> dann Fuß er hat mich auch dann. Aber er chillt einmal noch. I should so often have played so good clip and built it. For many years, I I have like this really weird problem with my skin. Like it's almost like a disease that I have only in like the hottest months of the summer, usually like often around June and July. And um, in Innsbruck, it was very bad again. My skin underneath the fingertips, basically, like all the way down here gets really really dry and it feels like the sweat can't get through and I can basically take the skin and just put it off and um, underneath that it's like very very thin skin this was a big problem my shape was kind of a problem and I just need like an extra week and um, it makes sense to skip VR and try to have everything perfectly prepared for Chamonix basically We're here in the climbing gym in Innsbruck. Today was a really nice session together with Alberto and uh, Nikolai. I always love to train with those guys. Always a lot of fun and obviously uh, they push me to train harder to get better. And uh, this is what I really need right now. Um, I really have to get back in shape. <laughs> oh my God. Ah, that's okay. Good enough. Nice dude. Semi-finals. <laughs> For sure. Green crimp on the blue. Then the good black Gaston crimp. Gaston is Schulter. This is Schulter. Yeah, Gaston. I thought it was French. I thought it was a hold. No, no, no. It means, it means like shoulder hold. Also, wenn es jetzt immer eben ein bisschen... Boah! Ah. I skipped VR because uh, I wanted to train hard and I wa wanted to get back in shape. Uh, but then, unfortunately, right after VR, when I was just training hard, um, I got infected by COVID. I was pretty sick for a few days and um, uh, I was definitely lying in bed and um, yeah after like a week or so or like a bit longer uh, I finally returned and I had to take it slow at first and um, just had to invest a lot to get back in shape. Obviously, I tried to be back on the wall as soon as possible after COVID. You have to care about your body and I was quite sick for a few days, so I had to take it uh, slow. I, I slowly started climbing again, doing easier routes at first and um, I did more and more over the last uh, few days and um, now I'm definitely back to like a normal frequency again. I'm uh, having um, a normal training week and it's something that I haven't had for a while anyways. Hi, we saw you in the beginning. Ich müsste es nochmal ausbohlen, hey, fuck! Unfortunately, I had to skip um, most of the World Cups this summer. Um, yeah, just some weird circumstances, uh, but it is how it is. And I still have the most important in competition, uh, which is the European Championship in Munich. But I will also do one extra competition, which is just, just always a lot of fun, which is the Rockmaster in Arco. It's just a legendary comp. Uh, I do it 
also for mostly fun. I mean, it's, it's an after work bouldering competition and a dual competition. So maybe not the most serious format, but uh, always a lot of fun. And also two really good friends of mine are going there, Nikolai and Misha. Oh, oh. The day before the competition, all of us climbers, we were like eight climbers, uh, had the chance to work one hour on all the four boulders. And we all get like three tries on all the four boulders, but it's a KO format, so you can go out on the first boulder if the first boulder happens to be your weakness. But uh, yeah, I feel confident I'm in, and I'm excited and then have the dual competition afterwards. So yeah, let's go. Yeah, finals went uh, perfectly. I was able to win the bouldering competition. It feels amazing after like a while off of competitions. It was a lot of fun uh, with all the other guys, Nikolai, Misha, Philip, and uh, yeah, I'm very happy that the bouldering round went so well. And now we will go really fast on the duel in uh, some hours, and I'm very excited. The second discipline is uh, duel. Uh, it's uh, even like a lot more different to the lead that we have at World Cups than the after work bouldering is um, because it's not really about difficulty it's about uh, climbing a lead route very fast uh, it's kind of like speed but in lead um, so yeah you're not climbing top rope but you have to clip and also the big difference of course is the route is much harder than the speed route it's around 8a or 8a plus when we went to Arco, it was already like a big goal of Misha and myself um, to be in duel together, like be in finals together. Uh, he did really well last year. I wasn't there last year, but I knew like it was his first time in duel, but he did really well right away. So we knew there, there was a chance we could make it and we could, we could go to finals together. Uh, so we were already talking before qualification. We have to get first and second in qualification, so we can only meet in finals. He slightly messed up, but he still got third uh, in qualification and I got first, so we still could only meet in finals. And uh, yeah, we actually fulfilled the goal and um, uh, made the dream come true, found the finals together. was an amazing competition again um, uh, it was just a lot of fun like being in Arco uh, with so many friends all the eight climbers were like really cool guys and we had uh, like a really good time on working the routes or work, working the boulders and uh, also on the dual competition uh, so it was overall just very fun and in my case obviously also very successful which uh, made it even better <laughs>